community. And you were longing to be part of that world. You knew that your family loved you, but you couldn't fit in for some reason. That's what you felt. Today, my darling daughter, I can honestly say you made it. In the last couple of years, I have seen you transform from this little guppy hiding under the sea to this beautiful young lady that has all the tools to make it in the mess, this mess of a world, as Sebastian would say. You knew that even though you grew up going to mass every Sunday, you wanted a closer and better relationship with God. And so you, and so you joined the Jornada movement. You quickly took your teachings to heart and acted upon them. You learned that to live ha a happier life, you needed to let go of those demons in your past and move forward. So you hung on to your old friends that you knew were going to support you and found a group of new wonderful friends that were going to do the same, but through prayer. And that's your Hornada family. Then you met the chapel players. We thank Matt for that, for introducing you to them and pushing you to perform and carry. That is where we witnessed the change the most. You were glowing on stage to see you surrounded by these people that were longing for the same thing as you and found, and found it through singing and acting. It was a true blessing. It made your, your father, Haley, and I so proud to see your happiness radiating through that stage by utilizing your talent and sharing it with the rest of the world. And so when you found another group of, and so you found another group of friends that you can relate with. To witness everyone giving each other that support was a beautiful thing to see. Then you took, a, took it up a notch and went as far as making a bold move to chop off your hair. <laughs> Without letting your parents know. Believe me. <laughs> <laughs> Believe me, this is something that a lot of young girls today would not dare do. But you felt bold enough to know that to start anew, that was something you had to do. And so the transformation continued. You got so many compliments after that your beauty shined through and they helped build your confidence even more. As you got closer to my friends in the Jornada movement, they liked you so much, they wanted you for their son. And so something magical happened throughout the time that I like to call a Christmas miracle. Without the parents introducing you both to the magic of Snapchat, you met JJ, <laughs> who instantly fell in love with you, not because of your body, but because of your heart and your brain. Imagine that, for a mother to hear that, that coming from a millennial man says a whole lot. I can honestly say ever since our home has been filled with nothing but joy and laughter. Today I thank God for the happiness you carry in your heart and your willingness to share it with the rest of the world. Now my little mermaid you have all the tools you need to be part of that world. <laughs> Wait, I love you and I can't wait to witness the next chapter of your life because it's gonna be good. Great, I'm not gonna follow that, but um, I'll try. <laughs>